How to set up Apple Pay on the Apple Watch Pay out on the run with your smart watch With Apple Pay enabled on the Apple Watch, leaving your credit cards stowed securely at house must not be an issue any time shopping. Actually, today the watch OS 3. One update is out, you are able to store much more cards on your Apple Watch to utilize with Apple Pay. Before you begin paying with your Apple Watch using Apple Pay, you need to update your phone to iOS 8.1 or later. In case you live in the UK, you may need iOS 8.3 or later. You will also have to be signed into iCloud on both your phone and Apple Watch to make purchases. However this is one time only through the primary setup. Just about all major credit and debit cards from major banks are backed in the US and UK, however, you can check Apple's list to check if your cards are supported. Finally, wrist detection and passcode must be switched on for your Apple Watch. If you switch off your passcode, wrist detect, or sign out of iCloud, all of your cards will be removed from the Apple Watch as a security precaution. If you're already using Apple Pay through your iPhone, you'll still need to add your payment cards to the Apple Watch. How to set up, up Apple Pay with the Apple Watch 1. Open your Apple Watch app on your iPhone 2. Select Passbook and Apple Pay 3. Choose Add Credit or Debit Card here your iPhone will ask you to set up a four-digit passcode for your Apple Watch if you haven't done so already. You also must sign into your iCloud account also. You can opt to have your Apple Watch unlock once you use your iPhone. 4. After setting up the passcode, you can finally enter your credit card details. Apple will automatically enter the card you use for the App Store, so you'll just need to set the three-digit security code. 5. Agree to the terms and conditions. 6. You can add more debit and credit cards manually or by positioning your phone's camera over the card. It will then recognize the relevant numbers without you needing to input any digits. You will, however, need to type in your name and the card's expiration date and security code. 7. Your bank will take a moment to verify the information and allow the addition of the card. Occasionally it won't work and you may have to notify Apple support. 8. Your Apple Watch will notify you via Passbook that your card is ready for Apple Pay. To start paying with your Apple Watch, make sure businesses you visit have NFC, enabled card readers that accept contactless payments like Apple Pay. 1. Double press the side button, the one that usually displays your friends list. 2. Your default card should pop up, so if you added more than one, you will be able to scroll through by swiping left or right. 3. Hold your wrist near the card reader until it vibrates and makes a sound. This means the payment went through. Good, now you paid for your purchased items with your Apple Pay Watch. Have a good time.